What's up, YouTube? It's your friend Mod Dagger back with a new video. This is on a demo. It's called They Are Here Alien Abduction Horror. It's one of those jump scare games. Uh, seen somebody else playing it. Figured we'll give it a try, see how it goes. Unexplained phenomena occurred at Gravewoods Farm on the night of August 7th. The Sherman family put his bright lights in the sky that moved at next speed over the car for you. The lights moved in a ram direction at different speeds. After a while, they vanished. The strange behavior in the sky was averted at the same time each night for five nights. According to the owner of the farm, all the animals went crazy. The dogs became aggressive, tried to attack him and bite him, bit him. The children complained as someone was walking under their windows. Former Peter himself in the field saw a strange figure that did not look like a man. What is it? Deliberate deception, drawing attention to oneself, or a sensation about alien invasion? During was Taylor Fox traveled to the Grayswoods farm to take a photo and make a report for the local newspaper. And I knew I was going to fucking read an encyclopedia here. Okay, let's do this. Alright. Talk to the farmer, Peter Sherman, okay? Check the graphics here. Hold on a second. Mm. All right, they're good. All right, where are we going? Sherman's house. The fuck is this? Oh, that must be the lights they seen. They got a creepy setting, I like it. <sighs> what was that? Hold on, let me get my headset turned up. Mr. Fox was made up appointment, but sometimes Mr. Fox, we made an appointment, but sometimes bad things happen. Our daughter went missing. My wife went to town to help my son and I, and I went to check out the farm. We'll leave notes for you and the police in case we pass each other. I'm trying to read the damn letter. Text is right there on the right. <laughs> All right. I guess we go inside. Answer machine. Phone's not working. Can I close this door behind me? Yeah. Uh, I don't like this. <laughs> Family pictures. That's what must be the daughter that went missing. Or one of them. I uh, thought somebody's coming in through the front door. It's this door. Milk. Mystery. Sky object seen here in Or no. Let's say this old loop has information about UFOs and crop circles. The phenomenon has been seen throughout the state for a long time. Why have I never knew about this? It's first on me too, so I don't feel bad. Um. Uh, House needs some work done. What the fuck is that noise? Oh, good doggy. The photo members of the Sherman family. The photo members of the Sherman family. Yeah, we got that. Excuse me. I think I feel something about to fucking jump out at me. Alright. We're in one of the kids' bedrooms, I presume. I 
It looks like the drawing was made by the missing daughter of the farmer. The paper's painted on both sides. Oh. It, the dog was barking, then the alien killed the dog. Girl said. Aw. Poor doggy. This is my daughter's room. During the night, I heard a strange noise. When I come uh, in, when I came in, she wasn't in her bed, and the window was wide open. I'm sure she was abducted by those things. Uh, I'm taking her name was Megan. Walkie talkie. Apparently, it belonged to the missing girl. If you listen closely, you can hear very strange sounds. Oh, wait a minute. Huh. I was trying to get the chills already. Alright, I don't see anything else in here. Did that, did that. Go to the parents' room. Wait a minute, those pictures, they had two kids. Ah, this is where the magic happens. I just see something move out there. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm just stripping. Ain't no such thing as aliens. Whoa. From the from the photo from the internet, perhaps Peter Sherman saw something similar. It looks creepy. Alright, are these all gonna read the same? Yeah. Man, if I see some shit like this, I'd be gone. Farmers know. I've learned a lot about these things. They called the greys. They are not little green men, but big, creepy, and dangerous creatures. Basically, they can be described in the following way. A large head, this proportion to the body. Mama's black eyes. Gray skin. Long, thin limbs. The voices are like nothing else. These aliens are very aggressive towards people. It all starts with bright lights in the sky near home, which move along a certain way. Then, people start to have a no nosebleed, have severe headaches, and a buzz in their ears. And animals start raging. Next, people start to have memory relapse. When they come back to normal, they find themselves in unexpected places, for example, in the middle of the field or on a road, a few kilometers away from home. Some of them have flashbacks of terrible memories. People remember terrifying experiences. The aliens established control over their minds, and this has affected their psycho. Also, they found the marks on the body and decisions to be backed during pal pal palatation. It felt like something thick, like a foreign object being under their skin. Well, fuck. Well, that sucks. But so far, no aliens. Hopefully it stays that way. Um. Oh, we searched everything. Let's... Nothing on the dead. What's this? Found my old diary. How can I forget it? Found my old diary from when I was 15 years old. How could I forget that? Today was the most exciting and scariest day of my life. I saw the aliens. My parents think I'm lying, but it's true. I was fishing from a band pier in the river. Suddenly, I was defeated, bended by a roar coming from behind. I turned around. Very low above the ground, a huge dish with four flashing lights or windows was hovering. I felt a punch that seemed to throw me into the air. I froze there as if zero gravity. Everything around me became blindly right and I seemed to lose consciousness. I remember seeing three aliens with gray skin and big eyes. I was placed on the table as if I was welded to it. They were standing over me. It seemed to me that they communicate with each other telepathically. The one of the then one of the them then one of them came over and did something to my head. I don't remember anything else. I woke up on the pier later in the evening but barely made it home. My head was buzzing and I walked home as if I 
as if in a delirium. When I got there, I found several cuts on my body and two small, very smooth holes behind my ears. What was that? I'm scared to sleep. So there's, so this is the other kid's room. So there is two kids. Okay. Behind the ears were a trace of them. 
I'm sure they implanted me with something, some kind of transmitter or implant. Because of this, I forget everything. I definitely decided that I would, I definitely decided that I would get it. I'm not crazy. Yeah, it just needs a little uh, tuning on the text. Oh, is that the implant? How did I take that picture last time? All right, uh, F flashlight. Ah, oh, Lord. Looks like I looked at everything in here. Must be an IMC alien. This is fucking great. You know what? Fuck this. Let's just get out of here. <laughs> Shit, son! Alright, we're gone. We're gone. Fuck. Alright, hurry up. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Fuck, okay. Uh, start this damn thing up. How we There we go. Uh, can you start? Oh, oh shit. Not good. In the full game, you will find a large territory of Greenwich Farm and a full story of alien abduction. Add this game to your wish list, the Yomas discounted release. Alright, there you go. Alien abduction. Uh, that, uh, I gotta say, it was pretty good for a freaking small little demo. Uh, I was half asleep when I started recording this. I'm freaking wide awake now. But anyway, I thank you for watching. I'll catch you guys next video. Peace.